Okay, so we're going to do a FPS test with the new graphic settings. Uh, we're just about to uh, get airborne. They're already they're looking quite good. Oh, I forgot you have to trim this. Nose down quite a bit. Let's get my trim sorted out. I'm flying above the ocean, so you'd expect us to be fairly high. Everything is looking utterly stunning as usual, but an awful lot smoother. Let's just have a fly over to me, nice and low. We usually get a bit of a dip now. When we go close to the ground, we sort of in the in the 50s, high 40s. It's never really dropping below 45. I've got um, what's it called? ASW turned off. Otherwise, otherwise it would just be stuck at 45 frames all the time. So I'm fairly low here. And we're getting uh, getting good frames into the 50s. Obviously, if I go a little bit higher up, um, depends where my head's pointing. If I'm looking at the blue sky, then obviously we're going to be going to be getting higher frames. So what are we at now? 2,000 feet. Airborne. So let me trim the nose down a bit. Wizard passing waypoint two at thirty thousand. Well, this is so much better than it was with the 980. For a start off, I couldn't have run these settings on the 980. And uh, secondly, um, you know, even with the lowered settings, I was not really getting anything like this kind of frames it certainly even when it was showing sort of 45 it didn't feel as smooth and uh, I've obviously got MSAA on that makes a big difference a little bit of a stutter there I don't know what, what that was causing, that might be something else going on in my system. Pontiac, passing waypoint 2 at 30,000. Bearing in mind I'm running uh, shadow play, so I don't know whether that's going to affect the frames at all. I think it might slightly affect them, but not, not hugely. <coughs> Alright, so the lens, lens flare effects look nice. I don't normally have those turned on. They're pretty realistic. I'm going to get a solid, uh, solid 60. Trouble is, well, I have to look up to see the frames, and obviously then they jump up because I'm looking at blue sky. All right, so we've 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 shown that. Let's get nice and low and in the valleys, and then see where that takes us. I we'll expect it to be in the uh, low 50s the trees look really good now much more realistic close up than they used to and I've got terrain object shadows on which I couldn't have on before it just gave me too much of a hit with the frames And when we look out the side window, it used to be a slideshow with the 980, but it's a lot smoother now. Whoop. Look out the front when you're flying at treetop height. There's no um, sort of laggy sensation. 
like they used to be occasionally if I turn my head quickly from side to side. There's a lot going on there. This is the this is where the frames take the biggest hit. There's a little drop there, drop down to about 20 for a second. There's like a little um, frame drop. But nothing like I was getting before. Alright, let's jump into another aircraft. So there's I think I think the um summertime map does kind of uh, take a bit more to drive it. But lovely and smooth. Don't, don't fly low. Low and fast, that's going to put the most amount of stress on the uh, GPU, I would think. As far as DCS goes. Then we'll do a multiplayer test where we'll go somewhere where there's a lot of ground objects and that does tend to hit the frames quite hard, I find. Alright, so we'll. Uh, Don't, don't do this in real life. Have a stroke. That was pretty good. Seems to be getting you know around 60 most of the time. So there's, you can see there's a lot of stuff spawning in here. So I'm, I'm just, uh, it, it's quite laggy when you first log in. Let's find uh, a helicopter. Turn those off. Alright, so we're now down to uh, high 30s and 40s. Just going to the F10 map, we can see that there's a lot of uh, stuff on the map. There's some uh, stuff over there. We'll go and attack that. I think. We've got, no, I haven't got any guns on. Better put some guns on. Right here we go. We want to go uh, east. Thousand feet should do it. That's pretty good. That's yes. It always feels smooth. Shadows look good. They used to flicker really badly before I had to turn them all off. Look at the uh, oh. zoom out a bit.
frames are in their 30s now. They're all dead. Quite. The door gunners have a go at him. So big, uh, big hit on the frames with all the tracer. Still a couple of them. Oh well, I think that's an adequate test. So, I think that's my test. Um, compare it to the video I made a few months ago with the 980 Ti and judge for yourself. Uh, see what you think. Thanks for watching.